What's going on guys? Cater here on a beautiful beautiful day my friend What's going on with your land? What's going on with your life? I'm here with my boy Mr. Chris Keys. <laughs> Alright, Chris in the house. So guys, I mean it's a pleasure to actually interview one of my students. This guy's been ride or die. Me and Chris has a really powerful story. I mean, we've been this online business and he's my brother. This guy is my brother and we've gone through so much together. I remember there was time I was going through so much in my life. It was so crazy. We didn't even know anything about business, like Nothing. you know, just making money online stuff. You know, I remember just being so depressed. You know, so we're making this video just to let you know wherever you are right now, whether you're yeah, depressed. Yeah, there's hope, guys. There's hope. You know, whatever life is throwing at you right now, I can tell you, you can live to see a better day. You know, as you grow, you learn, you're gonna get to the next level. You know, so you know, fast forward to now. You know, I was depressed. I remember being at Chris' house. Bro. Oh man, <laughs> I was going through so many tough time in my life, oh, and Chris man. was going through his own oh, tough time. Man. And I was very suicidal at that moment. And then life passed by, and then we actually grow. You know, God helped us, so we get to the point. And now, you know, we started this online business. And now, let's talk about YouTube, YouTube success. So I really want to interview this guy because I know Chris when he got started. You know, and in the beginning, he wasn't seeing the results that he wanted. You know, he was going to school, trying to make stuff happen. And then somewhere down the line, his mind shifted, which is if you're watching this video or you're part of my channel or his channel, the whole thing we're trying to do is trying to help you to shift that mind. Because once you make that shift, you know, everything started moving towards whatever you want, you know. And, I, and then now this guy went from not making any money off YouTube right now, which we're watching. And now what, wow. you, what you at now? I think right now, man, I'm close to 600 right now. So and I just recently um, posted up a video um, just a few days ago, two days ago, and I was at 475. So $600 in residual income with his AdSense revenue. So I'm gonna ask, cause you know, I've been in this for a while, so some of you follow me on my page, but as someone who's just come into the game, and, and to me, this guy shocks me. Like it took me a little while to get my channel to start making $600 a month in AdSense revenue. This guy literally just come on the, you know, he just hit the ground running, like really just crushed it out of nowhere. And I'm so proud of him. So let me, I'm gonna ask Chris a couple of questions. Cause I know you was working a job, right? Cause you, yeah. you was working a job, you was trying to make stuff happen. And trying then, to make things happen. Trying and to now make, you're not yeah. working a job. No, I haven't been working a job since, um, since a little bit like late 2016 into 2017. Okay, cool. Yeah. So my question: When did you figure out, hey, you what, you don't want to, you want to become an entrepreneur? Because I know you was going to school, you was making stuff happen. What happened and that got you to shift that <laughs> mind? Like we're trying to get people to shift their mind to make you realize, oh shoot, I gotta make this stuff happen. Well, like with me, what happened was that um, I, first of all, just like Kata said, you know um. We was doing this online stuff, but Kato was, he was in a situation or uh, a point in his life where he had to take this thing seriously, you know? We both was in two different phases in our life. So what happened was that when when Kato was doing this, you know, um, the online marketing and stuff, um, he just got married. He just got married, you know, it's, it's a real life situation for him. Me. I just turned 21. It's time to turn up. I don't got time to be in front of a, a laptop. You know, I tried the business for like, I think the first um, thing that we was in was like ZNZ, right? Right. We yeah. was in ZNZ and Kata took off with ZNZ, oh, but I did ZNZ for about like, I did ZNZ for about three months. I made like, you know, a little couple of, you know, sales here and there. But then after that, three months, I was like, yo, what am I doing? This thing is not really for me. I'm paying for AWeb every month, whatever. Fast forward, Kata, you know, a year later, Kata posts up his tax information and Kata makes six figures online and I'm still clocking in at my little security job. And now, you know, fast forward now, this, and that was like since 2010, 2011, right? Yeah, it was like 2012. Yeah, yeah, around that time. So, get started. so now, fast forward now, I stopped. Um, I jumped on Shopify 2015. After a month, I gave up. Now, where things really hit me is that you know, I'm in a relationship with my, my fiance and um, during this time, you know, I wasn't engaged and I end up, you know, um, getting ready so I could, you know, um, you know, propose to her. And as soon as I purchased the ring after I proposed to her is when I start thinking like, holy shoot, I'm about to get married. Like, I'm about to get married. We already had like a, a, a 
we get already gave ourselves a deadline for the the wedding to take place, and this after that, I start realizing that I don't, like the the money I'm making cannot really provide or really make things happen the way I want it to happen. So I reached up to a point where so much stuff was going on, my back was really against the wall. Like I had no hope. Right. And I told myself the only thing that could make things really happen is the opportunity that was always in front of me that I never took, you know, action on. So I jumped into Shopify, mm -hmm. jumped into Shopify, and I was hitting a lot of brick walls during my, my, my beginning phase of Shopify. But I told myself that no matter what happens, if, no matter how much walls I'm going to hit, I'm going to find a way to get over that wall. Right. So, like, you know... Here's the thing. Like, tell me one time in your business that where you hit that wall and you felt like, man, I felt like giving up. What was the thing that kept you going? Because we all hit. Because I know, like, I was talking to you, like, sometime in the process, like, you would have this go, 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 and you hit that brick wall, and it's like, dude, like, I don't know what to do. Because we all hit this part of our business, and that's where a lot of people ended up quitting or they don't have, they don't have enough gas to keep pushing. What kept you going? What did you say to yourself that keep you pushing or keep you going to this moment? There, there's a great um, motivational speaker. Um, I'm pretty sure a good couple of you guys heard him, but he always say, what's your why? Like, if you really put your why in front of you, you're going you're gonna to really take it to the next level. Like, every time, you, every time you hit that wall and you get in that feeling of giving up, remind yourself. Or if you got to write it on a board or, or even a, something that you could look at, Remind yourself why you even took that step so you, so you could keep pushing yourself forward because there was time just like Kate said like I, I felt like giving up and as soon as I remind myself like listen you're, you're, you're trying to get married this is what you're trying to do and and before, like when I started I didn't really think that I'm about to quit my job I was just thinking about the wedding but from me T like from for the wedding being planted in my mind now I, I no longer work for anyone I'm working for myself and not only that I'm growing a business so knowing your why will keep you pushing like put a goal in front of you like like if it's your wife if it's your kids if it's yourself maybe it's your future put something in front of you that you know for a fact that you telling yourself no matter what happens I'm gonna make sure I get this thing going crazy so now let's get into youtube now i know i've been on you like yo you gotta get on youtube bro like i i've been telling chris like for, for those of you that's watching also if you're watching us on and and you're just doing the watching i highly recommend you if you're trying to build a business online get on there like it doesn't matter if you're scared if you don't know what the hell you're saying your mind is running 300 pounds per hour you know like chris says if you have a why that's bigger than what or how you got to do things you're going to do things because your why is much more bigger. You understand. It doesn't matter what you got to do, how you got to do it, why. That's what's important. So that's, that's important. get on there and get stuff going for yourself. So now, bro, it's like it's crazy to see that, you know, I've been on you like, yo, you got to make videos. And now what shifted to get you to the point now? Like a lot of people don't understand. Like, you know, in our businesses, we make a lot of money, right? Yeah. But there's this whole thing about when you have residual income from a company, like I've done many multi-level, I wouldn't say multi-level company, but different affiliate business online. But a lot of the time the business model change or you don't know what's going to happen. Yeah. But now knowing that, hey, you know what, you, you're getting paid from Google AdSense and, and it's like the number one company in the world, like Facebook is number two, the number one company in the world. They're not going anywhere. They've been around for years, right? And for then years. you see that residual income growing every single day, it although it's smile. not the only thing that you do or you're going to depend on, but the fact that you have that coming in and you can see it grow and you're growing it. How does that make you feel like? It feels amazing. Um, and the fact that, you know, a lot of, especially, you know, in, in the field that we're in, you know, being, you know, marketers and stuff, um, a lot of marketers don't, I feel like they're not really taking, you know, um, YouTube as serious as they should. Like YouTube, Kato pressed to me how powerful YouTube was. You know, like I said, you know, I started, you know, doing Shopify. I ended up moving on and doing my own marketing business. And YouTube helped grow my business so much. You know, for the people who hate Facebook advertisement, let me tell you right now, if you hate Facebook advertisement, jump on YouTube. Yeah. You, like, imagine, imagine you're getting a hundred percent profit in your business. Like you're not paying no middleman, 
Nobody, like the money's coming straight for you. And every time that money comes in, you're not thinking about, oh, I got to give so-and-so the money for pushing this out over here, uh -huh. pushing that over here. And not only that, like imagine, not only are you getting 100% profit from your, your business every day, but you got Google AdSense that's paying you every month. Like what more, like, like what more do you want? It's funny that you say that because I remember there was a, a time in my business because I, I deal with a lot of people who just crush with, with, with paid traffic and paid advertising. I've, I myself do a lot of paid traffic and paid advertising, but a lot of people wouldn't understand like why not, why do I create content or why do I um, promote my stuff on YouTube like Chris just mentioned to you. It's because of the, you know, being able to connect the thousands of people, which is amazing enable myself to change lives even without having to be there like people all over the world are saying yo dude i watched your video it inspired me i was about to give up and quit because of one of your videos bro it changed my life and i totally make a whole twist 60 and now my business is rocking yeah i have people who say yo i was suicidal and because you share your story with me yeah and now that, that happened to me you know mm -hmm. I'm, I'm shifting my mind so it's, it's so powerful guys so and especially especially no, i'm not sorry to cut you off but especially mm -hmm. if if you're a person that just, like, you know, the thing about me and Kata is that we love helping people, you know, genuinely helping people. And it's not like when we get on um, YouTube, I'm pretty sure if you search through his videos and through my videos, we're not giving like, like corny content. We're, we're really giving stuff that could really, you know, you know, up, upgrade your, your business or even, you know, shed some light. To, to, to certain questions that you probably going crazy on YouTube, going crazy on Google trying to look for and you can't find it. And we're there to shed light, you know? And it's never hard to reach us just through our YouTube channel, you know? So so I think that, you know, especially when you're doing, you know, YouTube, you know, you just try to be genuine and that's what, you know, we do. So, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's totally crazy, guys. But anyway, guys, we was making this interview, you know, now Chris is, I mean, 500 bucks a month. That's literally, um, what is it? Like 5,000, 10,000. That's like, Wait, 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 500 bucks a month that's like five thousand dollars for the year so far you would accumulate and it in one year of youtube and as you grow it's like ten thousand. you know i know people right now who's making 10k a month and it's not just for the number guys money's always going to be there to be made but it's just the difference that you can actually act making people's lives and and being able to use that platform to connect to thousands and thousands of people you know building a business that's going to change lives and enable you to go to a whole next level i mean it makes me happy and it makes me smile to see you know people like chris come on board and just crush it to a whole next level so you know my my words to you if you're watching you know follow chris you know go to his channel he has a channel right now he's building chris keys oh yeah um keys with a z at the end so go out there and check him out. i do put his link down below in the description you know this guy's gonna do phenomenal things he's amazing um he has a phenomenal vision for his business and his family and helping you guys on, on YouTube, Facebook, wherever you follow him. So I think this is gonna be massive. It's gonna be powerful. You know, that was your boy, let's get it. Um, you know what it is, man. We are a man, Chris. Yes, I don't sir. Know if Chris got anything to say where he can connect with you, how they can contact oh, you. Oh yeah, um, you guys could, like you said, you can get on, um, find me on YouTube on, um, you know, Chris Keys, you know, K-E-Y-Z. Um, Facebook, Chris Keys again. Um, you're gonna see the same picture. I think it's the same picture that I have on my, my YouTube as well. Um, and also, if you got Snapchat, add me on Market with Chris, um, with Chris Keys. No, no, Market with Keys. Yeah, I'm on Snapchat. So if you got Snapchat, you know, you can add me on there as well. Let's get it.